Fans of the popular CBS drama series NCIS shouldn't anticipate seeing Special Agent Marty Deeks in the next season. The actor who played the part for all 14 seasons of NCIS, Los Angeles, Eric Christian Olsen, said lately that he had no desire to go back to his breakthrough position. At a press conference for the upcoming CBS series Matlock, on which Olsen serves as executive producer, he spoke with TV Line and gave an explanation of why he would not guest feature in another NCIS season as his old co-star LL Cool G did. I actively miss Todd, and I was texting with Renee Felice Smith this morning, and I see sister-in-law, Daniela Rua, all the time. He said. Having said that, he indicated he was not so much interested in playing Deeks once again. Olsen, who works as an EP on Matlock instead, seemed to be content with his role, saying that the show lets him mentally step into these really good, dramatic or funny scenes, because they're so beautiful. September 2009 saw the launch of NCIS, Los Angeles, the first NCIS spin-off series. The long-running action drama series centers on the investigations of military-related crimes by special agents Sam Hanna and Grisha Callen, respectively, portrayed by LL Cool J and Chris O'Donnell. NCIS. Love performed well in the ratings over its 14 seasons on CBS, making it the second longest running program in the series after the original NCIS. NCIS. La ended in May 2023, making it the second NCIS program to be cancelled following NCIS. New Orleans, which debuted in 2014 and ran for seven seasons until ending in 2021. Olsen may not be joining the NCIS universe again, but one of the show's most beloved actors will. Though it won't be on NCIS, Mark Harmon is finally scheduled to make his first Larry Jeffro Gibbs appearance on film in three years. In anticipation of NCIS Origins, Harmon has just completed filming new scenes that will go into Gibbs' early years as a newly minted special agent at the fledgling NIS Camp Pendleton office, where he forges his place on a gritty, ragtag team led by NCIS legend Mike Franks. Harmon will executive produce and narrate each episode, in addition to making a brief appearance in the first one. Austin Stowell will play the younger Gibbs. Showrunner Stephen D. Binder recently hinted that one episode of NCIS season 22 will explore what happens when a guy like Jason Bourne or James Bond, one of these really serious, high-end people who are involved in espionage, ends up in a retirement home, suffering from the things that all of our parents and grandparents suffer. Story details are still mostly unknown. The showrunner went on to say, what do you do when you have those sort of skills and that sort of knowledge and you're starting to lose your state?